Hi, hello, YouTube man. Check your clocks because it's temperature over time. Welcome back to Persona 5. In the last episode, we were just waiting for Okumura's confession, which he did confess, but unfortunately, he had a mental shutdown and he died, which I would totally call. So that's going to bring some heat on the buffers here because people are going to think, oh, we killed Okumura and whatnot. But I don't know. All I want to know is who shot him. <laughs> That's what I've been saying like the past last episode. And I even put that in my last episode title. <laughs> who shot him? <laughs> but I don't know. I guess we're going to figure it out later on. So let's just be patient and see what happens next. So you know what to do, guys. Leave a like for the crew, the buppers, amateur coon, which is me, and uh, the infiltration toolkit. Why not? Oh, boy. Let's just... Go. I just want to go to sleep and forget all this happened. What in the world's going on? Let's just go to sleep. I can't tell you what, what happened, Morgana. It's just... I don't know. <laughs> but hopefully Haru was in good hands, because, I mean, she lost her dad, so... Oof. <laughs> but here we go. Back in the dream world, I suppose. And what happened? On your feet, inmate, our master has an important matter to discuss with you. Heed his words well. All right. First, I'd like to congratulate you for expelling the one proud of their breed. Or so I'd like to say, but something odd seems to have happened. Uh, what happened? What happened? Who knows? However, don't you sense it? The malicious will of another. Yeah. It seems a contingency has occurred. At this rate, your rehabilitation cannot be completed. Though I doubt that will be the case. Mm. I truly look forward to seeing how you overcome this predicament. I do hope so. I feel like my bond with Igor is growing deeper. Yay. I almost dropped my controller. Okay, nine. Rank up. That's pretty good. He'll be the second one that I probably like filled out for bonding. Time's up, inmate. Hurry up and return to your world. At least it wasn't bad. It was just cut short. I like that. I'll see you later. Oh man. Oh, I knew it. We went down. Well, that was disturbing. Catch don't panic. Now who's next? His face. Holy shit. <laughs> Dang, I knew it. I knew her popularity would hit from that. Did you hear? Okumura died. It's all over the news. He collapsed during his press conference, right? I wish I'd been watching when it happened. You're probably better off. It was a total disaster. I never imagined seeing a heart attack would be so unsettling. The news says it was because of his illness, but either way, he spent it. Still bizarre. Damn, wish I'd seen it live. Ugh, that is disturbing. I knew it was going to tank our popularity. I knew it. Great. Now what are we what are we going to do? Listen this time. And in okay. this age uh pro projectarian proletarian literature is literature written by the working class. It looks like a J for some reason. Did you see that interview? I thought it was going to be a hidden camera show at first. I was so scared I changed the channel. He really looked like he was in pain. That was sick. Will you quiet down? We're in class right now. Not to mention, you have midterms starting on Monday. Focus on studying. Things are getting pretty bad. Uh, what happened? Afternoon. Oh, yeah, yo. Oh, that's my phone. Hmm, it seems police have shown up at our school. The police? What for? Your sister hasn't told you about any of this. Nothing at all. Could this be related to Okumura's death in some way? But there's no connection between our school and Okumura Foods. Did they came to talk to her? She's absent today. Then seriously, what are they here for? I can't even begin to fathom the reason. Anyhow, let's be particularly careful not to stand out and head straight home once the school ends. Everyone understand that, everyone? Okay. Oh man, this is really, this is actually pretty bad. What are we going to do? Uh, we haven't found anything useful as evidence. I see. Uh, we're hoping to find
find something more than the calling card, too. We've confirmed the victim's connection to the Phantom Thieves, at least. Thank you for your cooperation. Beep, beep, that's his phone. Speaking. Huh? They found a calling card in the principal's office, too. Wait, that, that happened? Oh, yeah, 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 he did die. I forgot. Yes. Sorry to ask again. Your father hadn't said anything about the Phantom Thieves, correct? That's right. Please contact me if something catches your attention. It doesn't matter how trivial it seems. You don't have to force yourself, though. Just anything that comes to mind. Hmm. The principal? No one told me about that. No, no one did. That's that is kind of weird. Oh, we're going forward, huh? Well, that's the story. I took the dude's heart. He died, and I have a very intense craving for hamburgers right now. Did you bring one? <laughs> so basically, your group didn't go after Okumura's life. And even the death of Shujin's principal, who we found a calling card for, was the work of another. <sighs> you don't sound like you're lying. Never was. If you wanted to deceive me, you could have easily woven up a much simpler lie in this metaverse. Moreover, your account coincides with my own investigation. Is that even possible if it were made up? Yeah. I hate to admit, but with my line of work, I know a false testimony when I hear one. Still, if you set your sights on Okumura based on my intel, it'd be before his name was even ranked. You could have ignored him and targeted some other famous person. Why would you go so far as to further investigate and pursue this criminal? Uh, I can't ignore a criminal. My teammate was in danger. Yeah, she was being sold off to some dude. Simple enough. There's still no proof that another suspect exists. That said, it's safe enough to say that you aren't the murdering type. Yay. Although I would kill <laughs> for a nice bird. I feel like my bond with size growing deeper. I would murder. Oh, rank five. Still don't know what this is for, though. What was that? Your next objective was. Hmm? What's the matter? Yeah. What's going on? What the world did the into you? Oh, I'm about to, I'm tripping. That's all. It's fine. It's just the poison injected into my veins. It's it's all good. And when you settle long enough, the golden gateway opens right next to you. You want to go there with me? <laughs> my vision is starting to get distorted. I can't hear you over the trippiness. You need to stay focused. <laughs> just like throw up all over. <laughs> just like a literal just kidney just comes out my throat. What you're saying is true. You must tell your side of the story to the end. I thought I was doing that. You will be in trouble if your testimony becomes unreliable. Or unless I die from these drugs that the police gave me. Eh, but we'll go with option A. Well then, let's move on. At last we arrive at your most recent crime. Ooh. You know what I mean, don't you? That's a calling card, right? This calling card was delivered to your latest target. The one you had decided would prove your innocence. It was addressed to Sai Nijima. Myself. Really? We tried to go after you? <laughs> oh, this is a doozy. Tell me more. Explain everything to me. Another target and it was her Makoto's sister. Huh. I wonder how this will tell. Show me the money. <laughs> Well, here's how it started, right? The summary of the story up to this point has been updated. Yep, yep, yep. Here's the story. I went up to you. You were like, I'm going to kill you for being guilty. And I was like, nah, fam. And then I grabbed you by the leg. And <laughs> what the heck am I talking about? <clears throat> has anyone been able to contact Haru? I'm worried about her. No luck here. Me neither. She won't pick up. It doesn't look like she's seen any of our chats either. I'm worried about her. Mm. Oh man, what is she up to? Been searching all along. I hope Haru's okay. All right, I don't think I can do anything, can I? Hey. We don't. We don't know when we might get a call from Haru, so let's stay put for a day. 
All right, so follow the situation still. All right. You still don't know anything. Go to sleep. What happened? Dang. Who shot him? <laughs> Thus begins the purge. Feels good, man. Does it? Shitlord exterminated. I don't get it. Coincidence? President Okumura died. Is this just a coincidence? Is there an illness that could have caused that? Nah, no way. So what if it was murder? That's terrifying. This might be the biggest event of the century. Mm. And October is still rolling around, so that could be. Oh, God, we're going down. I can't believe anyone now. So who done it? <laughs> what about his daughter? Oh, no, don't even say that. Oh, no. Let's see. Oh, Adam Coon? My apologies for messaging you so early in the morning. Things have calmed down a bit at home, so I thought there's something I need to tell you. What's the matter? Um, there's actually something that's caught my attention. I think I need to discuss it with everyone, though. We should meet at the hideout at the school. Sounds like Haro's managing, somehow. Alright, let's meet up with everyone after school. Oh, man. We're going down the, by, the, by the day. It's take Their popularity is just dwindling. I knew it. Was Okumura murdered? But that was a live broadcast, wasn't it? If it wasn't an illness, then it has to be murder. Didn't he kind of deserve to die anyway? Still, I feel bad for him going out like that. Mm. Ugh, I, I, my brain is like wrapped around this. I don't know. This dude over here. Allies of justice before they strike them back to the ground. Now then, she'll be next. Why do I feel like he's talking about Sai? spoken to human resources about it. It would be a heavy responsibility, but I'm certain it would be an honor for her. The culprits behind the mental shutdown cases she's been pursuing all this time. <laughs> Indeed. They'll become the criminals we've set them up to be, just as you instructed. Who's he talking to? What is going on? <laughs> God, this is getting so intense. I must know. So damn loud. I don't even hear it. <laughs> Where's Harry? No idea. She's the one that called us, so she'll show up eventually. Well, even though things have come down, she must be occupied with what happened to her father. Wait, what? What is it? What's up? <clears throat> People are posting that we killed President Okura. Yeah, I assumed as much. So it's begun already. Yep. I knew it. Oh, this is so bad. The CEO collapsed the way he did during an apology conference that our group caused. Still! We're raving about us so much. And now they just treat us like murderers? What a lightning fast change of attitude. True. They don't know a damn thing about our situation. Calm down. Not everyone is necessarily saying that. There's no way to vindicate ourselves. <laughs> hey. Haru. We're just dying inside, that's all. I'm the one who asked you all to make time for me, too. My condolences. Must be rough. I'm okay now. Um, I called everyone together because there was something worrying me. Did you all target the principal? No. I mean, she was never mentioned about it. What makes you say that? Yesterday, a public prosecutor came to my home. Um, it was a woman named Mijima san. <laughs> That's his sister. I overheard her saying a calling card was found in the principal's office. Considering that this was right after what happened, it's 
got to be shooting this It's the first I've heard of it. So this was the first time the calling card was mentioned. I know that he was targeted and like had a mental shutdown, but this is the first time we've mentioned a calling card. Huh. It may just be my imagination, but I feel as if things are escalating far too quickly after President Okumura's incident. What do you mean? Perhaps they may have been set up by the real culprit. For real? That could be. Yeah, I don't have doubts. We need to catch them as soon as possible. But how? Hold a moment. Can we assume we've been set up, though? We don't even know we're objective. What else are we supposed to do then? Let's all calm down for a moment. From what Haru said, even the police are suspecting that the Phantom Thieves are murderers. It wouldn't be wise to carelessly make a move at the moment. We need to act as normal students for now. Great. In addition, we have midterms next week. Even greater. Exams? At a time like this? <sighs> I envy you, Futaba. Futaba? Be asleep. Hmm? Got something on my mind. I'm gonna go home and look into it. I thought she was asleep. Like <laughs> she, she, <laughs> she fell asleep standing up or something. <laughs> we need to be and not draw attention to ourselves. Understood? All right, all right. God, why? What happened? <laughs> all right. This is a murder case? Don't tell me the Phantom Thieves did that to President Okumura. They're heroes. They would never do that. They'd be disappointed if they just turned out to be criminals. This has to be some kind of trick. They would never do that. I can't think of any other explanation. That has to be it. God, now they're pinning us as murderers. We're not killers. Don't think otherwise. The buppers are not murderers. For real? They found a calling card with the principal? But that's impossible. That's my phone. This is ridiculous. Why are people doubting the Phantom Thieves over what happened to President Okumura? They never do such a thing. Isn't that right? Absolutely. Yeah, I trust them. Anyways, it seems that everyone's forgotten all that they've done up to this point. That won't stop me, though. I'll continue cheering them on. Make sure you tell them that. Well, see you later. He seems a bit narrow-sighted, but he's a good person deep down. You can't betray him. Oh, yeah, yoy. What, I can't do anything? Yeah, just go to sleep again. I sleep a lot. So all we can do right now is just sit and wait? Seems like it. Ugh. Oh no. <laughs> Trash talking feels risky. Well, now I'm interested. Bloodthirsty killers are <laughs> not killers. No. Stop it. I'm sorry for worrying you, everyone. I won't be able to respond for a little while longer. You don't need to mind us. More importantly, are you doing all right? I'm okay. I'm more worried about the people at this company, to be honest. It seems everyone's having difficulty not only with clients, but the press as well. They're even handling the preparations for my father's funeral. I just feel so guilty that I'm unable to help out at all. You shouldn't. Everyone understands this is trying, a trying time for you. And we're here if anything happens. I know. I'll get in touch once things settle down. We'll be waiting. Thanks. Talk to you later. Bless that girl. I'm worried about others even at a time like this. Oh, yo, yo, We're getting pinned as murderers again. Why? I bet they killed Okumra just to make an example out of him. Awesome. Why else would they kill him during a press conference? I read somewhere that Okumra raised his daughter alone. Maybe he wasn't a great manager, but as a parent, I feel for him. Murdering someone to make a point is textbook terrorism. Like Shido did to that, and that Akechi kid say, the fan of these are a menace. Mm. No, how did the opinion like shift so quickly? No. Copycat crying? Have we been cheering on murderers all this time? It has to be a setup. The Phantom Thieves aren't like that. They're not heroes. They're just criminals. I believe the Phantom Thieves. They wouldn't do that. I'm really disappointed. Were they just lying? We're not lying. 
<laughs> We're not lying. Oh, God. I can feel this right now. Holy crap. And it's raining. This is not a good time for it to be raining. Who on earth set us up? Does anyone have any idea? Of course not. If I were to guess, I would see the culprit behind the mental shutdowns. Wait, how do we even know who was set up to begin with? They found a calling card in Principal Kobayakawa's office. Someone else had to have played that, obviously. And in the worst possible scenario, it's possible they know our identities. This is bad, guys. Yes, our state of affairs is looking quite bleak. Uh, <laughs> let's turn ourselves in. No way. Save the jokes for later, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a, there's a time and place for everything. This is not the time nor the place. Sorry, I, I retraced my statement. It looks like our only choice now is to find the true culprit. Although, we don't have any leads. Damn it, why has this guy that happen to us? <laughs> Dang, I felt Ryuji's like, don't even joke about this, man. Because I do that, like, on a, like, I try to make the situation lighter by joking about it. And there's... There's a time and place for everything. Some people will be like, don't do this. Don't do this now. And I respect that. So I'm sorry for what I said. <laughs> Wish we could prove our innocence, but we can't afford to make a dumb mistake and get ourselves caught. We just have to keep laying low and wait. Let's not do anything conspicuous, okay? Okay. Hey, sorry for bringing this up when things are so chaotic. I know it's tough after what happened to the President Okuma and all. But this is the perfect time for smaller changes at heart to restore your reputation. Anyway, here's the info I have. If true, this one's pretty crazy. Apparently, an ex-mercenary who works as an assassin is hiding out in Shibuya underground. He acts like a homeless person during the day, but then goes about his work at night. He hasn't left any trace of his identity, though, so there's nothing the police can do. Sounds dangerous. Right? I can't breathe easy knowing he's out there. Well, according to the rumors, his name is Yohei... Kiritani, I'm seriously scared. I don't want anything to do with this. I'm leaving this to you, the buppers. All right. But she really does get some amazing info for us sometimes. Our reputation may have taken a hit after Akuma's death, but we can still prove our justice in the Mentos. We should discuss with this when we have the time. Oh, and we have to meet up with Taru before we can go in. The killer who cleans up trash. All right. Be ready for midterms. Oh, yeah, that's happening too, huh? Ay ay ay. Exams are close. Exams are coming up. Have your studies been going well? I can give you gen a general idea of what they're like when they I was a second year. What do you think? Wanna study together? Sure. I I think tomorrow then I guess we'll do some other stuff. I will do the mementos off camera, like as I always do. Hey. Trying difficult problems is good, but the most important thing is your fundamentals. Well, how are they? Good, I think. Well, has studying with Makoto to deepen your understanding? I suppose. More knowledge. Thank you. I don't know. Getting back to the basics is necessary when you're lost in both studying and regular life. This is a great opportunity for me to review as well. Thanks. Okay, let's try a few more complicated problems now. Okay. Be sure to go over the materials in your head before you go to sleep. Yeah. Got a studi, studi, studi. A studi, 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 studi. Evening. Thank you. I hear the Phantom Thieves killed someone. It's all over the news. Uh, it's not me. Uh. Cafe's open a little while longer. What will you do? I can teach you the ropes. Um, um, I'll help him out. Why not? Put your stuff down and grab an apron. Don't forget to wash your hands. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sojo's guidance is extremely precise. I did just as he told me. I don't think my bomb with Sojo will deepen just yet. Hey, thanks for helping out. You're welcome. Oh, God. <laughs> Hurry and arrest them. Well, regret bagging them yet? We can't leave them be. God, our stuff is going down. Oh. 
What do they what do they want anyway? So they were just deceiving us? I guess Akechi was right after all. No, I still believe the Phantom Thieves. They're murderers, right? Hurry up and arrest them. How long are the police gonna let them run loose? Oh we got even sides. Some were saying we're murderers, some of them are not. Oh, this is so bad. It really is. This sucks. I wonder when Akumura-san will start coming back to school. I know the funeral soon. It's just, it'll be tough organizing the funeral for a big wig CEO. Akumura-san is usually pretty quiet. Do you think she's okay? Hard to believe that the dad of such a nice girl could be so evil. I didn't expect this from the Phantom Thieves. It was a full-blown public execution. Ugh. They're doing just what they wanted. The people, whoever's like pulling the strings. So we were set up, bait and tackled. Things are looking rough online. They're just calling us a bunch of murderers. All the celebrities are supporting us are being criticized now too. It's all gone up in flames. People are posting about this stuff everywhere. I highly doubt that anyone who supported us did so honestly. There have just been many who simply went with the winning side. I get mixed feelings about this when you put it that way. It does make me rethink a lot of things. That aside, we need to deal with our situation first. Our state of affairs continues to worsen. We can't just sit back and watch this happen. Still, we can't make a move when we don't have any leads. What are we supposed to do then? Right around when your exam then will be a perfect timing. Uh, for what? Don't worry about it. Anyway, just wait and see what happens. For the time being, let's discuss things after our exams end. Ugh, there's no way I can focus on exams like this. Can you ever? <laughs> hey, amateur. You, pay attention. Is that how you listen when someone's talking to you? I feel a murderous intent. Woo! <laughs> Get out of here with that. I learned from my past mistake. Whoa, that was an epic dodge. That was nuts. Is he a ninja? <laughs> well, whatever. Moving on. He's the only one that throws chalk. No, oh, you got the entire class's attention. Your charm has definitely increased. Dude, I dodged that chalk. Get out of here. Charismatic. He said, yeet. <laughs> awesome. All right. People are saying terrible things about us, calling us murderers. Uh, oh, speaking of which, I want to do this real quick. Let's draw, let's draw this. Let's see what happens. Ah, the Phantom Thieves. President Okumura died because of the Phantom Thieves, right? I heard they're behind all the weird shit that's been going on. They tricked us good, huh? Does that guy not watch the news or something? Way to bring the mood down. They're treating us like villains or something. Damn it. Okay, make sure it's totally erased. Oh yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, what's what's my phone? Phone, phone, phone. When are your exams? Are your exams coming up for you too? Mine are soon. Studying together could be a good strategy. However, I cannot guarantee that I will be a help. Well, let's study anyway. Understood. The blunt should be fine, correct? Teach me, <laughs> teach me your ways, fellow art man. Got to study, study, study. Before Monday, Monday, Monday. LeBlanc is so comfortable. My mind works at a faster pace here, thus helping me progress in my studies at a marvelous rate. Absolutely. You're going faster than normal too, but I think it's because you're studying with Yusuke today. I like Yusuke. Yusuke is amazing. Knowledge. Oh, I wonder what number five is. Is that the highest stat? History is truly my best subject. It is necessary for grasping the nature of art, after all. Now then, I will answer any questions you have. Cooperation is a part of the thrill of study. Hmm, I'm having trouble with this part in particular. I believe I somewhat overstayed my welcome. See you later. I saw Yusuke off to the station. Oh yeah, he don't live here, do he? He lives in like a completely other train station. Oh yeah, yeah. Dang, I forgot to get my coffee from Kamakami. <laughs> so the Phantom Thieves are murderers. I guess all the praise they got before it doesn't amount to much now. Oh, you can't even make it. Get out of here. 
Ah, uh, it's you. My apologies, I was submerged in my thoughts and lost track of the time. I'm sorry for staying here so long, but I will be leaving soon. I must be going now. The coffee was delicious. Thank you. Alright. Make me some coffee. Make sure you're close up. Sure you're close up. Shalom. I don't know why I keep saying shalom a lot. I think my friend is like giving me <laughs> mixed messages. <laughs> Exams are such a downer. I'm really bummed about tests coming up. I'm in trouble for anything that's not English. I haven't been studying at all. I'm fluent in English. Oh, maybe we can make some progress if we keep an eye on each other. Want to study together? Sure. You're a big help. Then let's meet at the diner in Shibuya. Why the diner? Oh yeah, she's here. <laughs> Forgot. I'll head to the diner now. <sighs> that long sentence is tough. Try to think about what the underlying section means. Are you starting to understand how to dis dissect these problems? Yeah, it's English. It's literally my only language that I speak. I'm so jealous you get to be on a one-on-one -on -one study session with Lady Yawn, Adam. Seems like you're making more progress than usual, too. That means more knowledge. Knowledge. I'll be smarticles before you know it. That's I'm actually not so good at this because of my time abroad. Anyway, time to study. Here we go. Do you think you can help me with math next? Okay, math is not my subject. I'm sorry about that. Well, you, I will 100%, you will fail if you try to do math with me. Simple math is good. Algebra. Good luck. <laughs> Hi. Yay. Coffee. 16 cups of coffee for my, my Joe. Oh my God, it's going down. Hurry up and execute them. No, don't kill us. Ugh, we were fooled. Got anything better to do? Criminals should die. Yikes. That's my phone. Promise list step three. Promise list step three. You'll help me with this, right? I'm eating now. Maybe I should respond later. I guess. I'm going to open up shop suits. So I'll need you to do the dishes once you're done with that. Yeah. I guess we can respond once the dishes are done. And make sure you thank the chief for breakfast, okay? Ben and Nan and Nan. Okay. Oh, yeah, yoy. They still haven't caught the Phantom Thieves? I don't care how they do it. Just throw them in the slammer already. It's too scary to have murderers on the loose. I wonder what kind of people the culprits are. They're murderers. Don't give me any this justice crap. Hmm. We are not, but Oogie. Now what? Can I bother you for a moment? Now that the funeral's over, it feels like a small burden has been lifted from my shoulders. Are you alright? I am. I actually feel bad having everyone worry about me. How about you? Are you doing okay? Uh, managing. You sure are strong. I'll come back, don't worry. I think I'll be able to rejoin everyone around when the exam's end. Um, we'll see ya. Haru. She's the one who should be in pain right now, yet she's trying to cheer us up. Oh yeah, yay. I'm managing, that's all. Wait, don't I gotta do something with Futaba? Or something? Oh. Exams start tomorrow, don't they? You should just focus on those, you know. We'll get to work once your exams are over. Oogie. Okay, so, uh, I have this. I feel like I'm by bun with Futab. Let's go see her. <laughs> so tomorrow we have midterms. So the next promise is learn about my generation. Wait, I think I could do the next one, too. Have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Hmm, where can I find lots of young people? All right, let's By Jove, I think I've done it. Let's be off, Adam. Well, you guys are actually starting to get pretty close. Not like it's a bad thing, though. Anyway, be careful out there. By Jove. Where are we going? We're not going to the beach, are we? Because 
That's automatically off the list. Okay, the diner, that's fine. So we arrived at the diner. I've heard all about the unlimited fountain drinks at these places. Well, where are they? I don't see them anywhere. Hi. Amateur? Oh crap, you were the girl? Is this a friend of yours? He's in my class. Oh, that's right. Hmm, how about I ask him to help me with my promise? What promise? Oh, well... You just want to have a regular old conversation? So, wait, you're saying that you, a girl, want to talk to me? Yeah. I see. In that case, I don't have a choice. Nope, none whatsoever. I'll just have to help you out. Really? Oh, you're so nice. My name's Kotaba Sakura, and don't you forget it. Uh, uh, okay. I'm Yuki Mishima, but everyone just calls me Mishima. Hmm, <laughs> seems like help always comes my way when I need it most. Maybe my luck stats really high. You're what? <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. I'm a gamer. My luck? Don't you know about stats? They're like points that represent your particular aspects of your being. How about you, Mishima? Are you into this kind of stuff? I should have said yeah. It's actually Mishima. Oh, what did she say? So you want to learn more about our generation. Like, that'll be easy to explain. Youth, the unknown frontier. Hmm, maybe I should try talking about my hobbies. Do you like computers? Mm -hmm. I'm always online. Me too. What sites do you use? I usually keep the forums myself. Or are you more into streaming? I gladly subscribe to your channel. But, but wait, do you by chance run one of those racy channels? You need to do. Be, you need to be super courageous to do that. Though it certainly wouldn't be unwelcome. Kick. Okay. Well, that's the first time I actually I heard anyone actually say that out loud. Kick. Okay. Huh? That's all you took from that conversation? <laughs> Kick. Ah, I got it. The overwhelmingly forgettable appearance, generic speech style, and total lack of sex appeal. Nishima, are you an NPC? Savage. <laughs> oh, that hurts so bad. <coughs> I felt that too. Dang. But it'd be even more savage to lie about what he is. And besides, NPCs are an important piece in the jigsaw puzzle of gaming. You're not making this any better. And more importantly, my name isn't Nishima. Anyway, I'm glad you spawned here. I killed two prophets with one Nishima today. Learn about my generation and have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Ah, yeah. I think I gained a ton of experience on this adventure. And it's all because you brought me here, Adam. Thanks. I guess that's who taught us innocent joy. Very good. God, gamer terms. Love it. <laughs> Loving it. So, uh, Futaba-chan, it's okay if I call you that, right? I'm a little embarrassed. <laughs> anyway, uh, what are you doing after this? Going home. Oh, right. Aw. Come on, Adam, we're off. Dang, he thought he, thought he had a chance. Oh, <laughs> I'm so sad. I know that feeling. All right. That was, uh... Eventful. This isn't much of an update, but I think I'm going back to school starting tomorrow. I'm sorry for worrying all of you until now. Are you really okay, though? Be sure not to push yourself too hard in this time of grief. No, I actually need to push myself. My mind always wanders if I'm letting... <coughs> Excuse me, I had to burp. If I have nothing to do. Yeah, I totally get you. Besides, there's nothing I can do while I'm at home. Well, uh, I don't know how to put it, but try not to think about that stuff too much. And if anything happens, you can rely on us. Uh, we're on your side, Haru. Um, to be completely honest, when I ended up alone, I did doubt you all a tiny bit. We cannot blame you for that. But it's so horrible for me to doubt you. I mean, I'm the one who asked you all to do this. Your father just passed away, Haru. It's natural to feel a flood of emotion at such events. Yeah, it's really hard when you lose someone like that. But I'm okay now. You all helped me out so much. Right back at you. 
Thank you. Those words are really reassuring. Well then, I'll see you on the new school. Haru, oh, I'm not surprised she seems down. You should keep her in your thoughts, Adam. Still, despite how she looks, Haru's got quite the backbone. I'm sure she'll be okay. All right. Let's see. What do I got? Shop's open. Zam soon. Zams are coming up soon. You're not getting to jump on without studying me, right? If you're going to do it, you want to do it together? I'm in serious trouble. Uh, hold on. Decide later. Let's see what Sakura is going up. Got time right now. Got time right now. Still won't be able to bond with them. But uh, I guess I'll study with Ryuji then. Zam soon. Go right away. That's a huge help. I'll be waiting over in the diner in Shibuya. Oh boy. <laughs> now what? There's too much shit on these exams. I'm never gonna catch up if I try to learn any everything. Alright, let me predict what parts are gonna show up on the on the test. Uh here, here, and here. Come on, you can trust me. You sure about that? <laughs> It is worrying, but Ryuji seems pretty lucky, so maybe you should try trusting him. Of course, you might want to study everything else later, too, just in case. Okay. Knowledge, smart boy. You don't got a thing to worry about, man. And if we fail, at least we'll be together. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, how about something to eat while we're at it? Fries okay? I like fries. Fries are pretty good. All right, Worth the crap ton. Let's go home. As long as it ain't sweet potato fries. Oh, I should have asked for coffee. <laughs> Dang it. Dude, I'm going down. We were at the 80%, and then now we're back at 40. So many things. And it's raining. Procrastinating girl. Pulling all nighters is the worst. I really should have started studying sooner. At least a school festival soon. It's the thing I'm looking forward to most right now. Yeah, but are they still going to hold it? It might get cancelled. Don't say that, you're bumming me out before the exams. Things are bad enough as is, if they cancel the festival, the students will riot. What's with this festival? Alright. I hate Tess. Did you hear those rumors? I wonder if they really are from our school. Really? No way. But what if? What if what? I need to know. Oh yeah, it's exam time. Got it. That went up pretty quick. Who's that? Pretty bad, huh? The Phantom Thieves have gone off the deep end, don't you think? I thought they were going to change this, that CEO's heart, but they ended up killing him instead. Haven't people been saying that they killed Principal Kobayakawa too? I thought they were bad, but I never expected they'd turn out to be murderers. Oh man, does this mean everyone who gets targeted is screwed? <laughs> Quiet down. I'll be handing out your exam booklets. Great. Exam time. I don't know, do I even remember any of this stuff? <laughs> I highly doubt it. Wow. Let the first day of exams begin. What is the origin of the word guillotine? Um, name of the one who proposed it. Yeah, I got that. Let's see, an essay question? This looks tough, but let's calm down and think it through. Explain why the guillotine was used during the French Revolution. First of all, who proposed the idea of the guillotine? It was a doctor. Yeah, I think he was named Joseph Ignace Guillotine. So from his perspective, what was the advantage of the guillotine? It was... Execute people quickly. There were thousands of people executed during the revolution. Looks like they needed a method of execution that was quick and impartial. Yep. You finished in time. Cool. Time is up. Put down your pencils and your hands on your desk. I can't hold the controller still though, right? Uh, oh man. They even steal lives? P quick. Switch the sides, lol. What about the politicians? What about him? <laughs> hey! You're still rooting for the Phantom Thieves? You know they're murderers, right? That doesn't mean that criminals should be left to do whatever they want. 
Still, they couldn't have at least left the principal to the police. And I mean, did you see that press conference? No way Alex and Justice would do that. I wonder if Akechi Kuhn has been right all along. He's so admirable, sticking to his guns even though there are many people against him. Now, everyone. That's enough. If you don't quiet down, I'll have to ask you to leave. Alright. Oi, oi, oi. So this is what, the second day of exams? Now, everyone. This will be the second day of exams. Please begin. Which of the following statements about this ball is true? Uh... Wait. It's a right... I know something that had to do with TV. But what? Was it black and white or color? I'm gonna go with it. It's a different color TV. That doesn't seem right. Uh, what is the meaning of robotic? Robota. The suggest word that root word for robot. That was... Slave labor. Yes. Thank God. I don't have a guide for this, by the way. I'm not cheating this time. This is all for memory and guessing. Oh my god. Be quick to switch sides, lol. I kinda sympathize. Mm. Alright, so I messed up one question. Hey, you. The fan of these have gotta be students here, right? I mean, they killed our principal. Isn't this insane? There are murders among us. Now that you mention it, there was a guy in Shibuya who told me he's a fan of these the other day. For real? You gotta report that. Oh crap, you think so? I snapped a pic, so I should probably just put it online just in case. The cops catch him. Alright, time for more exams. Dang, what was it about the soccer ball? It was something to do with TV. Hmm. Okay, class. Today's the third day of exams. Go ahead and start. What is the English name for the phenomenon where it feels like your cell phone is vibrating? That is, ah, oh, crap. Phantom vibration syndrome. Ooh, yes. Nice. Okay. Which of the following government organizations did the Karamat fishermen of Naragawa belong to? It was none of the above. I think they were just normal people. That doesn't seem right. Ugh. I think I'm doing good. <laughs> oh, God. Copycat crime? What's a catchy coon saying? They must be punished. Dude, we, we're we so down. Today's the last day of exams, huh? Seems like some of those were kind of tough. Well, it wasn't too bad. You should have gotten a decent score, right? I hope so. Because I think the first test I failed... <laughs> and then the next one, I scored perfectly because I cheated. <laughs> so let's see what happens when I do on this one. The police are here again? Yeah, it seems like for real this time. Apparently one of our students is a phantom thief. Seriously? I read the same thing online. Apparently public security is already on the move. That's my phone. It's me. There's something I want to talk to everyone about. I'll be at the hideout. I mean... My place. Okay. So what, you don't do exams on the last day? Is that a not a thing? I guess not. That's my phone. I received word from Utaba Chan about our upcoming meeting. There's still some time until we meet them, so I'm going to take care of my flowers first. See you later. I suppose plants do need watering after all. And ah, I know. You should go help Haru out. I'll let the others know. Okay. I was I was kind of hoping that was like a helper or something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how troubling. Hey there. Oh, Adam Coon, have you come up here to assist me? You um uh, heard that, didn't you? <laughs> how embarrassing. I'm not worried about the garden, in case you were wondering. It's just so much has happened to me lately. Any way I can help? Hmm. Well, perhaps I could share this with you. I mean, it would be nice to have someone who is aware of my current situation in life. Um, the source of my worries is my father's company. Dealing with the aftermath has been difficult. Given how unexpected the accident was, my father didn't have a will. All his thoughts transferred to me. 
which means suddenly I'm the biggest shareholder in the company of 1,000 employees. But I don't know the first thing about business direction and fund management. Uh, I couldn't imagine. Yes. Yes, it's quite hard to fathom. I may be the president's daughter, but I never anticipated I end up involved in company matters. Because of that, I've been meeting with all the various officers and lawyers my father employed lately. They've been giving me advice on all the things I'm not entirely sure about. Assets, stocks. It's clear some people only want to get on my good side, though. I don't know who I can trust. They try to sound comforting by saying things like, don't worry, or leave it to me, but it feels like they're really only being nice when they can get hands on my bank account. I, I never realized that could be distrustful for other people. Uh, I'm sorry for ranting on about this matter. It feels as though doing it helped me calm down a bit, though. The only people I consulted up to this point have been employees. But I think what I really needed was someone closer to my own age, closer to my own viewpoint. Um, if it isn't too much trouble, could we speak about this again some other time? Sure. In return, I'll... Hmm. Mm. What can I do to help you? I don't have any unique talents. How about this? You know, darn me. I'm actually quite skilled at it. A few years ago, I managed to grow my own tropical fruit on the balcony of my house. To be honest, this is what I do when I'm alone and take my mind off of everything that's happened. Oh, that's right. I store some vegetables in the refrigerator down in this home economics room. You saw some time, yes? Would you mind waiting here a moment? Sure. I'm getting veggies. Um, I grew these right here in the very planters and harvested them myself not too long ago. There's not much consistency to their color of their shapes, but... Uh, I want to try them. Give them. Do you like vegetables, Adam Coon? That's good to know. They're okay. I, I, I like. I like fruit more than veggies, though. But to tell the truth, I have a favor to ask of you. I'd like to get Sakura San's opinion on my vegetables. Do you think I could bring my next harvest over to your cafe? That's a great idea. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sure Sakura San will give you his honest opinion. Make sure this next harvest is particularly good. Okay. Shall we go? Yeah, let's go. All right, so we're getting veggies and foodies. <laughs> I'm down with that. Always down for someone who makes food, whether from a pot or from the ground. Congrats on surviving midterms. Yeah. I, I think I'm screwed for real this time. I couldn't concentrate at all. I mean, it's not that loud to me. More importantly, what's this more to talk about? You said that something was on your mind before, but were you able to figure out what it was? The magic that I damned wasn't the real one. Huh? Huh? Aren't you the real one, though? Oh, uh... Set us up. Time our group started getting popular, so maybe they wanted in on the hype. Wait a moment. What if it's the other way around? Mm -hmm. Perhaps they use the med shed name to make the phantom thieves know. What? That makes no sense. I actually thought the same as Makoto. Why is that? Know how I just said that code is like fingerprints? Uh huh. I found those same fingerprints somewhere completely different. Where? Where's that? The 
phantom aficionado website. There were traces of it being illegally tampered with from the outside. For real? For summer vacation, the access counter was made to be much higher than the actual number. Same with the rankings, particularly the time when President Okumura ranked first. So then, the one who provoked the group and the one who tampered with the site are the same person? Please don't be Mishima. Yeah, we were baited from the beginning. This is all hypothetical. We like any hard evidence. But if all your deductions happen to be correct, that would mean we've been playing right into their hands for the past two months or so. We gotta be overthinking things. I mean, we're talking both the rankings and the medjet. Everyone made a big deal about it. If this was all set up, then... No idea. There's no point in getting anxious over speculation. Regardless, we'll be falsely charged at this rate and with murder. We must overcome this. But we don't even know who we're up against. Hey, you think we're falling into another trap? Even at this very moment? We don't know yet. But how? Uh, where are we going to find clues, though? That's the problem. Oh, man, we've been set up from the beginning. <laughs> that sucks. You're fired. I was told you recommended this reassignment yourself, sir. Why would you choose someone as inexperienced as myself? Because you're fired. When the case of the Shuji principal was ruled a suicide, you sought to reopen it. And you proved its connection to the Phantom Thieves. This is based primarily on that achievement. I'm honored, sir. You're fired. The Phantom <laughs> Thieves issue is now a national crisis. Expectations are exceedingly high for us public prosecutors, as we are the executors of justice. Personnel and planning will be up to you on this case. You will also have the release under your command. I'd like you to oversee this operation. <sighs> Which is probably another setup. You get to give an answer. Will you accept the task of eradicating the Phantom Thieves? I will give it everything I have. We'll have to prepare a higher position for you as well in the event that you succeed. Now, I don't wish to apply extra pressure on you. But I assume your odds of success are high. Naturally, failure to accomplish this task is unacceptable. Do you understand? Of course. I will live up to your expectations no matter what it takes. That is all, then. I expect good results from you. Yeah, that's, that's probably another setup, if anything. That's what I'm getting from. Should I warm up dinner for you? No, it's okay. How about a bath? No need. I just came home to get a change of clothes. Are you going to stay at work, sir? Uh, they have a bath there. <laughs> very important task. You look awful, though. Aren't you tired? As an adult, there will be times when you will accept an assignment for which failure is not tolerated. It's all over for me if I can't win this. It's called life. <laughs> Still, if you were to collapse from exhaustion, this is my one chance to get a promotion. She's I'm ready. Promotion. Your that must make it hard to focus on your studies. Don't worry, though. It will all be over soon. What do you mean? I'm going to catch the Phantom Thieves myself. That's very bad. 
It's none of your concern. Kinda is. She's part of the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Not that I would say that out loud. Yeah, she's like, oh jeez. He's coming for us. I need to let everyone know. She's coming for us. Unfortunately. What to do? What to do? Beep, beep, it's my phone. Things have become somewhat troublesome, everyone. Just try to stay calm. What's wrong? Sis told me she's been entrusted with an important task regarding the Phantom Thieves. That means... Yes, the SIU must surely be on the move at this point. That's bad. Wait, weren't they already investigating us, though? The police were doing so in a secret. This operation is on a much different scale. Hold on a sec. What's this SIU thing, anyway? The Special Investigation Unit, an elite team that deals with huge cases like government scandals. I've heard of the name on the news. They make headlines often. The real insane part is they haven't lost a case against a suspect in like 50 years. If they come after you, you're screwed. That's the best investigation force in Japan. Are we going to be arrested? Hmm, somewhat. Doesn't this countermeasure seem somewhat extreme? Right or wrong, I think we're just way too famous at this point. This is a country governed by law. They can't afford to ignore us for any longer. We may be the Phantom Thieves, but this is miserable. They probably have a pretty narrow suspect profile by now, too. Hey, don't scare us like that. It's okay, though. They don't have any evidence. Yes, I expect they're frantically searching for some as we speak. No way they're going to find anything, though. It's only a matter of time. We have to hurry and do something about this. Everything's going to be fine. Unless they know about the metaverse. There's no way they'll get any info on us. Ugh. That is scary. They got the best government team coming after us. <laughs> Holy crap. We are so screwed. Seems very convenient timing for the prosecution, though. Alright. Prove your justice society. Find the true culprit and elude the investigation team. <laughs> oh, man. Well, this is a good time as any to end the episode here, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and save. And then... We'll see what happens next. But until then, guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like. Also, comment and subscribe to get new feed on videos and become a member of the Cuckoo Crew today. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitter so you can recommend the pitch games over to play or chat, your preference. Also, if you subscribe, be sure to tap that bell to get notifications on videos so you'll never miss one from me ever again. But that's going to be it from Persona 5. In the next episode, we will elude the investigation team, hopefully. We don't get caught. But... We'll just see, as always. So until then, guys, have a nice day, have a nice night, and the is out.